I suppose because last year was pretty phenomenal. Uh, we were really aware. So I think this time with having a bit of warning about it, we were able to be more prepared. Um, a lot of us I know stayed home just to make sure that we could keep an eye on things because last year uh, it happened during the day but we weren't prepared for it. Whereas this time the day wasn't so bad but the night was meant to be worse. Um, so people sandbagged and did as much as what they could. I mean it's not so bad where we are because the angle of the waves isn't as direct for us but some of our neighbours were, um, were severely severely hit and it was quite traumatic for them so so I was up at four o'clock this morning uh, and I went for a bit of a walk and it was a bit messy and because I knew that it was going to be a bit higher a bit more rough at uh, 9 15 it was still you couldn't be complacent about it sort of thing but again I am the epitome of complacent and I tried to go to work and, and sort of I was walking along and of course you're walking along because we're quite a tight community and you're talking to everybody, hey Tim, just like that. And um, I was talking to that guy's wife and uh, a wave came on and we we're like, oh, look at that, it's come, oh, it's gonna hit us. Oh, like we should probably get out of the way. And because you're just like, I should do something about this, I fell over <laughs> into the wave. So this is my second time of trying to go to work. Uh, you know, and it's what, it's 10.30. So, you know. Um, Shit happens, man, eh? <laughs>